In this video, I'll quickly show you how to download and install Sozi on a Linux operating system. So I'll just go ahead and search for Sozi. I'll include the link in the description of this video. It's not Sozi.com, it's this .fr is the developer's website. And then just go to the latest version. At this point in time, it's 19.0.4. And scroll down and we'll just click Install Sozi. So these instructions should work on um, most Linux operating systems. They have a Debian package, but that one was having some dependency issues. And so I'll do a more broader one anyway, um, which is going to be just downloading this archive file, and then we just install it. So to get the file, we need to go to download the latest release. So left click here, and then we'll scroll down, and we have some different options. So you could, like I said, follow the Debian instructions, but I'm just going to do this archive. I'm going to get the 64-bit right here. You can also download for OS X if you have a Mac or Windows. I have another video showing how to do that. But I'm going to do the 64-bit. We'll left click this and we'll click Save File and click OK. And then I'll start the download. It's about 40 megabytes. I had already downloaded this previously, so I'm just going to stop this. And we'll go to the location it downloaded, which is my downloads directory. From here, we just need to open up the command line. So you can just open the, the terminal, or you could just right click and go Open in Terminal. And let's go back to the instructions. So we'll go back. And we'll just go to these instructions, which are right down here, showing us what to do. So first, we just extract the archive. And so to do that, uh, we just do this command, T-A-R, and then the flags X, Z, F. Oh, first of all, let's just look and make sure that the thing is there. We can do LS. And we can see this is the uh, directory or the archive that we want to extract. So we do tar, X, Z, F. And then we type in that exactly word for word. And you can just type in the first three letters. Remember, it is case sensitive, and then hit the tab key on your keyboard to autocomplete and hit enter. And what that's going to do is take a second and then create a new uh, or extract it and put it into a folder. <clears throat> so we see that folder is right here. And if we go back to the uh, file system, we see it's the folder is here and we have some new things we can interact with here. Uh, and so we're going to open up, get back into here and go to the next step, which is just this sudo. Well, first of all, I'm just going to CD into it. So we cd into that new uh, directory, and we see what's in there. We have this install uh, folder, and so we're just going to go sudo dot slash, uh, and then the name of the, uh, oh, well, it's in install, and then it's install.sh. So this command here will get us there, and that will just, uh, we have to put in our password, and that's just going to go through this um, script and install it on our system. And so now Sozi is installed. We can type in S-O-Z-I to launch it. And when you first open it, it comes up with a uh, dialog asking us for a uh, SVG file. So I'll just choose a, a file on my computer. And now we have Sozi right here. We can uh, open it up and we can zoom in and start doing stuff with Sozi. So check out some of the tutorials uh, to learn how to use this software. It's really cool, really great software. If you like it, um, please consider supporting the development team. Uh, they've done a great job with this software, and I look forward to catching you in the next video.